Okay, so what we're going to do today is going to show you how to set the tension on the belt. So as you can see, the belt's completely loose now. I'm going to set it up straight. Then you're going to go to your eccentric with a quarter inch. You go to your eccentric. You're going to pull it. You start seeing that it's starting to tighten. You don't want to over tighten it. Come around this side. You don't want to over tighten it, so what's going to happen is it's going to be loose on this side. You're going to tighten it from the eccentric. You're going to feel it's going to tighten only at the back and not in the front, which is fine. But don't over tighten it in the, at the back. Just give it a little bit of slack so that it's still tight. Tighten the back one and a half of the belt width and then it's still loose in the front. Okay, I'm going to keep that up there. I'm going to come to the three bolts that holds the horseshoe together. The 9 16 and we're going to tie down these ones, these three bolts at the back here. Yeah. Right hand side, top one. Tighten the top one first. And as soon as you've tightened the top one, you'll feel that the tension down at the bottom is one and a half. If the tension is too much, redo these and then just set the tension on the eccentric again. Then you can tighten up the three bolts on the horseshoe. Hand tight. There we go. Same on that side. There we go. And your tension in your belt is set. Two three quarter inch wrenches. Okay. We'll tighten up, lock it in place. There we go. Then to tighten these, we're going to need to lift up the engine cradle a bit. Screw these ones down in. As soon as we got the one, the other one will just slide in. Just need a little bit of lift. There we go. We tighten our knees. That's it. Belts all tighten up. Okay.